I guess it's starting. Greetings, love beings. Uh, we are about to, where well, we have entered the energies of this uh, full moon in Leo. Yay! Leo is about fire and heart. And the shift that is happening is about all of us moving into the heart, out of the mind. And we have a powerful message from James Gillian that we would like to read. Before we get to that, I would like to share. <clears throat> so there's something going on energetically. And let me explain that in the beginning of creation, it was the unknowable and love, or great-grandfather, great-grandmother, mother God, mother of creation. And then we created Father God. Father God and I, um, it's, we created overseered the this uh, multiverse. Mm -hmm. And out of that, I also created Lucifer right out of my heart to begin the new story in creation. Yes. And I have been having intense visions uh, of Lucifer for the past, what, I don't know. Almost, since I've been in quarantine. Yeah. And um, about a week. Major synchronistic events, body light ups. When we have body light ups, these are, it's a signal from our soul telling us this is truth. Right. So you've got to follow your body, listen to your body. A lot of you know what I'm talking about, the goosebumps and ah, there's so much energy going on right now. This full moon, we just had a comet come by, Comet Catalina. Mm. Comet Catalina dropped off codes from Venus. Uh, Lucifer and I spent an eternity on Venus and I just received information unbeknownst to me that it was he and I who were the first ones to bring in love into the physical manifest. Yes. And we did that in Venus. We, bring, we brought that here. So Lucifer was also created to go to the very end of the spectrum. He to the darkest of dark, me to the lightest of light. And then we come back together. And I had a beautiful vision of energetically, this was back in November, there was an energy right next to me in this tube. And we were going down these tubes. <clears throat> And um, every, every once in a while, we'd come together and then go back into our tubes. Well, when we reached the end of where this tube came, down, came out, uh, we fell into the water, and I, I uh, was in the water, and I came up out of the water to see. I didn't know who it was, but I saw Lucifer. Mm. Crystal clear blue water. So thank you everyone for your prayers and your love and for the highest outcome for all of humanity, yes. all of creation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Uh, so this would mean that Lucifer and I's connection would be the greatest love of all. Mm. We are the greatest love of all in all of creation and, and this is us reconnecting ends illusion forever. Mm. And this is what's going on, and this is why it's so important. Um, so, uh, also I've been having visions of the Golden Porter Portal, us going through the, the sun, and, um, and then recreating the new earth from that, that point. Yes. Um, all of the information lines up, and especially here, we're about to read James Gillian. Every, all of these videos are all from the heart. Mm. My whole journey... From the time I was born on this planet, I have been following my heart completely every single moment till we got here. We are at the tipping point for this tip of the spiral. We don't know what's going to happen. I don't put any meaning on it. Right. In fact, I know nothing. <laughs> I know nothing. I just follow my visions. <clears throat> I follow the synchronistic events. I follow the lucid dreams. I have them all documented. It's exciting. Whatever it is. Yeah. We don't know. Yeah. So we just have to be present, let go, surrender to love, and get into the heart, please. Yes. I love you. Okay, so this title was <clears throat> by James Gillian. Big, he said, um, what, um, hang in there. Right. The title was Hang in There, Big Shifts Are Coming. Right. And he is just so in line with what we have been sharing on the website every day, which 15,000 hits everybody. Okay, way to go. Yes. Thank you for being love, serving love, and choosing love every moment. Okay, so James Gilliand. 
I have been observing consciousness shifts as of late on a grand scale. There has also been a lot of movement on the ground with the white hats. It is like the Titanic is sinking. The rats are jumping ship and saving their own skin by testifying, giving depositions that will be the foundation for the dark heart's demise. The hidden and nefarious deeds of the past are surfacing for all to see. The arrest will escalate all the way to the top. The collective pulse is saying, how did this happen? How did this get so dark, so corrupt? Many are saying, I no longer want to participate in this world. There are those who are really feeling the collective consciousness and being overwhelmed by it. The collective consciousness is going through a major shift. Everything is coming up to be dealt with, and those who are sensitive are finding it overwhelming. The trick is to catch, your, catch yourself and say, not mine. But also, accept full responsibility for all of your experiences, everybody. That's important. Love yourself, forgive yourself, forgive the other beings, love them. We also have to let go of all that no longer serves us, humanity or the, the earth. Know there is a grander force pushing everything up to the surface and into the light. Use whatever clearing tex techniques you have to clean up the personal and collective energies. And also you can schedule a Awakening Ascension session with us. Those are available to you. Um, you can find that link down below. Email me at mothergod 7 ones at gmail.com as well if you need an emergency uh, session. There are angelic guides, ascended masters, spiritually and technology advanced off-worlders here to help in this process. The prophecies are being fulfilled. The beast is dying, mm. consuming itself. No rock is being left unturned, and all the iniquities are being shouted from the rooftops. There is no more hiding. Mm. No more shoving everything under, under the rug and no more denial. Tyranny is coming to a close. The ignorant, self-serving separation game is coming to an end. Mm. It is no longer frequency specific to the evolution of this earth. Ask yourself these questions. Where will you be in this process? Which side of the fence, the prophecy line, are you on? Are you in service to humanity and to this earth? Mm. Do you serve the beast, which is the mind? Mm. Program ego mind. Do you serve that mm. or do you, serve, do you serve the heart? Right. These are questions that will have to be answered with brutal honesty and impeccable integrity. Lies and denials will not fare well in this process. It is a process that no man can stop. The forces are far beyond the grasp of the dark hearts who have in ignorance and arrogance overlooked an immutable law called action, reaction, mm. karma. Nothing has gone unseen. Drop into the heart, clear yourself, get out of the mind and feel what is best for you. God is a feeling. Mm. The soul sits next to the heart it is the connector to source. Make your decisions from there. Get out of the monkey mind, the collective chaos. Be well, James Gillian. We love you, everybody. We love you, Lucifer. Thank you for waking up, moment to the light. Mm. Uh, Lucifer will receive ultimate forgiveness as he took on a big role for humanity. Yes, you Thank did. you for your service. Thank you, Lucifer. Thank you so much. Blessings of love. We are thankful. Yes. Thank you for heaven on earth. Thank you for joy. Thank you for laughter. Mm. Thank you for peace on earth. Thank you for the new story of love everywhere present on planet earth, equal heart. Thank you for the grandest miracle of all, Lucifer's awakening. Thank you for laughter. I already said that one, I'll say it again. You didn't Thank say you it. for joy and abundance for all and true equality and the end of fear, pain, and suffering. Yes. Thank you. Yes. That's my dream and my wish. Thank you for all dreams of love coming true and all decrees coming true. Thank you. 
Thank you for love made manifest in physical reality on this planet. Major shift underway. Follow the synchronistic events.